Hello, great people of Nigeria. Welcome to the Leadership Clinic. Today, I'll be speaking to you of what I simply titled, Forget That You Have Failed Before. My journey for leadership development started 27 years ago. I was a young boy of 19 years, hungry to make a big difference for a great country. I wanted to build leaders that will make a big difference. In my journey, I have met with several people who said to me that they have failed. Some failed badly. They are stuck with the past. And so whenever they want to make progress, they are held back by the fear of failure. In life, leaders must learn that failure is actually part of life. The fact that you have failed does not necessarily mean that you do not have the capacity to reinvent yourself and win again. Leaders that are transforming the world today, leaders that have made history, names that have become names that we can reckon with. Books are filled with stories of such leaders who fail severely but refuse to give up. You can only quit when you have decided that you want to quit. Losers are those who quit. Winners stay the course. They refuse, even if the environment is challenging, like it's challenging in our country at the moment, even when the stories that we hear are actually discouraging. Leaders understand how to tap into the power of the future. The power of it will get better. The power of things are forming. The power that simply says that it is possible I bounce back again. So the winning spirit is the attitude. Leaders who have the mentality of rising when they fall, these are leaders who will make big, 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 big impact in this life. As a country, it is true that we have failed many times and the pain of failure is, is actually planted in each of our hearts. Several people, they have believed that Nigeria cannot get it right. Today, I am talking to you, listening to me, that it's possible we get it right this time. Nigerians should vote for whosoever that they want to vote for. Nigeria is going to have a free and fair election. Can we encourage the people of this country to believe that we can save this country and get this country on the path of progress. We can make it happen. Great people of Nigeria, you must remember, when a man doesn't have a purpose of waking up, sleeping becomes interesting.